Okay. Good evening, everyone. My name is Emily, and I'm a senior at Townsend Harris and the head of the Easy Esports Press Division. We're starting off this weekend strong with our very first Valorant match. But before we get to that, I have a short announcement about the Press Division's current mission. Current mission. Our job is to encourage the legitimization of Easy Esports by bringing attention to DOE officials, and I need all of your help. So let's just start off with a short history lesson about the origin of Easy Esports. The idea to start this organization was created by a group of club presidents as they sought out to find an esports league for their club presidents to join. Unfortunately, the only option was HSEL, which is a for-profit organization that charges students thousands of dollars to compete. With this in mind, the president started Easy Esports to fulfill the strong need of a cheaper alternative. Unfortunately, even with their attempts, Easy Esports has received no support on how our student-led initiative can become legitimized. Now we are trying a different approach. We are reaching out to all of you so that you can help us achieve our goal. Remember, activism is the only way we can succeed, and I am excited to work with the students here as we fulfill our goal. Thank you. Thank you for the introduction of Easy Esports. Today is our anniversary, Easy Esports anniversary, so I'm really excited to be broadcasting our opening game, Townsend Harris versus Francis Lewis. And I'm here with casters. Oh, I'm Dolphy Vicks. I'm one of your casters today. I'm a sophomore at Stai. Hi, I'm Lewis. I'm your other caster. I'm a junior at Stuyvesant. Guys, we would never be biased in favor of Stuyvesant. Oh, we would never, no. No. It's a good thing this game doesn't have any Stuyvesant in it. Otherwise, we'd have to show our real colors. You know, it'd be very unprofessional of us if we... If we were biased. But we're not, so it's yeah, okay. Exactly. But hello, everyone. Okay, uh, I just got the maps from everyone. Uh, do you guys want me to like send it to someone? Yeah. Oh wow, they're running ads. I just got a Google ad logging onto this stream. Wait, what? No way. No way, they ran ads. I just hopped on the stream. Are you getting an ad? Oh. No more ads. Guys, you like our new, uh, our new overlay? Look how nice this looks. Honestly, it's really cute. I like it. Mm-hmm. I see a lot of L Town sends in here. A lot of uh a lot of BM. Guys, the game hasn't started yet. Wait, let me pop on the stream. Shouldn't you go and wait for like the game to start and then you can start picking sides? Oh, there's an L Francis. All right, is the game ready? Mm. Hey guys, it's time for you to make predictions, or at least soon. When the oh, game starts, you're gonna see a poll and there's gonna be two options. You can choose Francis Lewis or you can choose Thompson Harris. Map one is Haven. All right. Wait, what are the three maps? We'll learn the other two in a second. Hold on. Okay. Oh wait, wait, wait. Map, map one is not Haven. Wait, wait, no, no, no. I, I the thing. Hold on, I copied the wrong call. Yeah, first map is this one. Yeah, Yo, what is what is with all the W Townsend? What is with all the hate? What is it all the hate? They gotta rep support. Come on. <laughs> all right. Can I ask? We don't spam I paragraphs spot. in chat. It's okay. Until the game starts. 
I mean, it's when a... the game starts, you go you go spam as much copy pasta as you want. I don't care. So, you guys, freedom of speech, but it's limited. Uh... All right, we see we have a lot of Townsend Harris people in the chat and also a bunch of Franny. We should probably administer that betting thing. I forgot what it's called. It's been a while since we started. Uh, what is it called? All right. Uh, the first map is Ascent, guys. So, on the left, we have... What is it? We have we have Francis Lewis on the left, and we have Townsend Harris on the right. And um, already we see chamber picks for both sides because chamber's just such a good pick. Uh, we didn't get any chambers this match. I would be very concerned and confused. We have a Phoenix coming out from attacker side here, from Townsend Harris. Well, Phoenix is is a strong pick on ascent. Strong yeah, pick, well, really, especially for entry. Yeah, we've seen a bit of um. And VCT champions. Townsend's on the right. Anyways. So this is the beginning of the season. Uh, these are brand new teams. Uh, because there was a... Uh, because lots of people from old teams had to go to colleges and stuff. We've got a lot of freshmen coming in. New talent. And... First game of the season, and this is gonna set a precedent, maybe, because this is this is um this is what what we want to remember. This is like a moment Choose in your in, his, in easy sport history. And this is only B team, so it could it could only get better from here. And now the game's about to start, and all these locks are coming in. We see the double duelist for defenders. Uh, we see the double sentinel. Uh. These are very, very different teams. I mean, sure, Mirror Smokes, Mirror um, Chamber, but, you know, different initiators. Those are different forms of of information. Flashes. I'm surprised we, I'm surprised we don't have any um, double initiators here. You know, double initiators has been very strong lately. Yeah, I'm surprised to see the double duelist come out, actually, because in Ascent, it, it, it really doesn't require too much space to be controlled. I mean... You have the sentinels they can lock down your mid for you you have initiators they can lock down basically any part of the map they can they can like get all that information and folks we have this match underway and be sure to vote on the predictions use up your channel points and see who will win uh again anybody who's just tuning in this is our debut match between francis lewis and townsend harris welcome 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 and happy first birthday to easy esports woohoo Thank you all for tuning in. Uh, today we are joined by Shoutcasters Dolphy. And We've already we're just, introduced ourselves. Oh, we're just reintroducing ourselves again. Um, oh, the match is getting underway. No, we need to start the match. Yeah. All right. So we we see there's a five stack, uh, all the way on um the B side actually, coming out right now. Somehow, uh, Birdie's not gonna die there, and actually Hiroshi's gonna clean that up. Two picks. Still no kill on Birdie. Scraped away, Butterfly took damage too. And that was probably like the best case scenario. I mean, how often are you gonna get a full flash on yourself and not be taken out? Get saved by your teammate, get two picks. Looks like they're gonna try to get mid control here. You can see that omen going into tiles. And defender side is also split up again. Right now they're just waiting for, you know. Any sort of re-hit that KO Knives is going to spot out too. And then the real call is, do they back off or do they stay? Now here's the haunt. It's not going to spot out anybody. The professional is going to go down on the opposite side of the map. Not ready yet. Shadows traveling. Are they really oh, going to take? Are they really going to take B left. here? Fade dot comes out. They'll probably try, but I really don't think there's anything they can do. 20 seconds left on the clock. Last player standing. Ooh, 1v5. Hiyoshi finds a third on bottom frag. One. And yeah, two. Phoenix is gonna find two. What? Really clean turnaround, but you know, there's only so much you can do when there's three people rushing you from all sides and angles. 
Honestly, that pistol run could have been worse. Right. Now, Lewis gonna run away with the first round. And we're on to the second. Need a uh, basically a full buy, yeah. Well, it's just, just what you would expect to see. Um, you know, from the winning, winning side. No force coming out of, um, out of attacker side here. I know that and there's a one force split. And you, you gotta wonder what Phoenix is planning to do here. Ooh, Nothing. Rosie's gonna take him down. Lots of noise A coming from Townsend as they back off towards mid. Rosie might be calling this though. They're making a lot of noise. Look at the chamber lurk on B side. He might be able to get the Reina here. Yeah, but Reina's protected it herself. Uh, Professional is not really anywhere close enough anyways. And that Marshall is so strong right now because there's nobody with shields except for Phoenix. Who is entry anyways, so needs some sort of buffer. I mean, you're useless without the shield. If you're just like going to get one tap by a Marshall. It looks like rotates are coming in to be here. Right, now the haunt's going down, but the call has already been made. They've already surrounded that. Yoshi finds a beautiful headshot on... Yo... Rosie gets another through smoke! Right, now it's just uselessness because Sayo's found professional. Whoa, what is this whiff? Uselessness is going to go down to Saifo after a four-shot whiff. Round again is just not going to go... In the way of uh, Townsend, but now they have guns. Now they have a chance. They they have vandals and phantoms. Looks like they're gonna try the same thing from last round and go towards A here. Right, and I think I think something that could really help them out right now is just maybe full rushing a site, full pushing because they have all this wonderful util that that could help them just get onto site. They've got Phoenix, Flash, Sage Wall, Fade stuff. Chamber TPs, and you know none of that is really being used. Watch though, Fluis is fast rotating over to A. Enough people still standing mid just in case, and enough time has been passed that you know they need to check wine. Fate dogs coming on onto site, but there's no entry. The cypher's gonna smoke it off. Temporarily. There's just like an A main. Really haven't done much here. Looks like a flash is coming out though. There's a flash. Ooh, There's a kill. Using this. Finds one. And now all the rotates are coming out. This one's stuck on the side. Psycho. Can he get him? No. Psycho's gonna find one before he goes down. Professional finally finds the trade. We reset into a three versus four. Make that three v three. Roses is going off here. Finds one with the marshal. Beautiful kill and a very important pick as well. Spots up bottom frag. However, Izok is gonna take down Rosie. A whiff onto Heishos, and every single person left standing will get one kill on the side of Townsend Harris. The force works out, works out for them, but I think their eco is kind of suffering over it. Right. Those two guns really screwed them over. They should be able to get one more here, though, um, off a of buy um, from Izo. Eos. Okay. Oops. Anyways, I would. Guys, I would never invent the word fluis um, and then use it continuously throughout games. Phoenix. All right, Rosie just gets hand fed two That's kills. Almost gets a third, but you know, this miss is a bit too early. And it's I brought down to 65 health at the least. I think you can already tell who's going to be carrying this match here. Right. right. Professional is going to go down to Sayo. It's a 7, it's a 2v5, and they haven't even gone into any of the main controls. Saifu finds bottom frag. Rosie gets a third of the round. They didn't even get out of spawn. They were just never allowed to leap, and that's like, that's the site lockdown you want to see.
I think a full buy coming out from both teams here. But Rosie does have that rain all. I'm surprised they're even full buying. That's true. I didn't expect them to have enough creds. Like an A, like an A hit, straight A hit here. They're playing off of that KO knife. Rose is about to peek this and get the perfect kill onto the duelist, no less. That's their entry gone. And yeah, these phase util will be popping up, but there's no one really on site for her to latch onto. Now there is Yoshi and Psycho jump down. Yeah, that's the flash is gone for um for Tonson Harris here. They're really lacking all that entry that they need. Oh, but Birdie peaks gets a little heated actually. I think he over peaks that. So we reset back into a 4v4. With only one person really holding down B side, and it looks like it's gonna be a B hit unless Rosie has something to say about it. Spots out professional, doesn't get any hits. Now Phoenix is in market because he's teleported in there, but watch, he has a spike. It's very dangerous angle for him to be in right now. Especially alone. Left. Actually, he's gonna find a kill into Sypho. They Lucas, don't know Lucas, Sayo I... is oh. on Sai. Oh. No, no. Oh, he gets one. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. And that spike down. Gets a second! Can he get the third on lane here? Ah. Uh. It looked like he was lagging a little bit. But... Two nice kills. Could could have been a better round. Um, It was very winnable, actually, for uh, Franny. But I think that peak from Birdie really just threw it all away because then they lost their smokes, they lost their control over the map. Yeah, Meanwhile, Phoenix... Phoenix had the perfect TP, but watch, watch the well, look at the credits. Aren't they kind of low on cash? You want to yeah, play, I was gonna say Franny. Play. Franny's a little. I mean, Townsend Harris is a little low here. Cover going Couldn't out. be going for more of a bonus. Cover going out. Joke's over. You're dead. The Phoenix Holt's coming out. Catch is one. Catch is the second. Two. Two. They get the third. Almost Catch get the third. third. That's a lot of space. That's a lot of space, and that's very good on their... On what is not a full buy. Maybe not a save round, but still definitely not full. Last player standing. And Useless and... ends up with four kills this round. Yeah, somehow they scrapped that round together, and Townsend Harris just... They get that round yeah, pretty decisively. Three. Yeah. And actually, they put they put Franny on a save. Oh yeah, this could be another round for them. And if it is, Franny might have to reconsider. Like, they dominated the first two rounds. They let their save round go, which was fine, and then they got a really nice round, uh, fourth round. But now they just let they've let Franny uh, they've let Townsend win win two two rounds. They don't want to let that happen again. They're putting Rosie here. There. Doesn't even shoot. Uh, Ooh, the crouch just to get out of the way. Face your fear. Fatal's coming out here. Right. And the Phoenix Into the flies. shadows. It catches out Birdie. Oh, but Sypho with the shorty. You will not kill my Finds the trade. No, but the, the res comes back. Making it a 5v3. 5v2 now. Not sure if Sypho wants to pop Blade Storm. Oh. Gets one kill with it. Spike planted. Not gonna get a second. Like and Bottom Frog is gonna just take down both Sypho and Sayo. Another round for Townsend. Right, but that was the save. Franny needs to figure out something here. If they want to get back into this. Looks like they're switching up their setup a bit here. Weapon here. They're st oh, never mind. They're gonna do the same setup as last time. We have actually Sypho and the Judge. Nope, never mind. He's taking a Vandal. Ah, uh, as a Judgment, I'm very sad and disappointed. 
The KO knife is gonna spot out at least three there, and they're all gonna just start running away. Chamber trip mid just to gather some information. If there's any at all to be gathered. I just want to point out, useless does have his pixel up. His a fake dog clears out a main, a uh, b main. Oh, but that smoke is still blocking it, so they don't actually know if someone's still there. Smoke gone now, they can check. And the running back comes out. Right, but he, he doesn't he, get the same value as last time. He turns it off. And actually, a little bit of damage stuff from both yeah. sides. Oh, and Sypho's gonna find Eos! That's the Sage down. Now the spikes all the way on eight. Bro, oh, he's he gonna cancels. go back. The perfect cancel. Looks like they're gonna go for mid control here on the side of Townsend. Yeah. A beautiful kill from Rosie. They can't quite get Rosie though. Yoshi. Uh. No. Yoshi's gonna find one, but Phoenix and Butterfrag are quickly getting those trades. As now we're down to a 2v2 and they're going one to be executing onto the B side. Sypho finds bottom frag. Now nah, Phoenix looks into <gasps> 2v1. Right. That's one. Oh. But, oh, the timing falls down while Sypho peeks out. And Franny scraping back together. Finally getting a round in their favor. Right, 4-4. Four to four. That's what they needed. It is, but... The Their eco is, yeah. The eco, it's still so low. They only had one person survive that round. They're gonna go for another A stack? Probably yeah, an A split. I guess so. Rosie's. Opting to take a wider angle here really wants that first pick. Rosie's been good doing, you know, what, getting those first picks, but. You I know, yeah, Ro Rosie's really helping out her team here with that. Yeah, but it has more to do with crosshair placement than it really does with raw aim. Hey, don't downplay Rosie here. I would never. And it's so tantalizing because we can see the enemy team through the smoke. All it takes is one shot, and Rosie could have killed or done so much damage there. Looks, as, looks, like, looks like it's a stalemate here. No one really wants to do anything yet. Townsend Harris really do like to just sit and wait and stare. They're hoping someone pushes up, but I don't think Franny's going to fall for it. They've already lost one round by someone overextending. Yeah, and watch. Oh, Fate look at Chain Run be here. Professional for a bit left. of a lurk. We only have 30 seconds. So, he gets Lurked one, by okay. Sayo. And now the... The execute comes out on A. And it's the perfect bait. Because Useless is gonna find... Rosie as... He's trying to walk away. 3v5, reset. And don't forget. Franny on a save round. I do want to point out where. Not dead. I do want to point out where um, where professional is here. He may be able to get a, ni a nice cheeky pick here. He could get a good time. As soon as they pass it. Oh, the cross. Right, they know there's one uh, health though. What in the world is this? We'll get the kill eventually. It's fine, but it's still a two v three, and they're both. Oh, low. chambers in heaven now. That's professional gets one. Oh, okay. Will not kill Hayoshi, second. but Hayoshi can't get out anyway. He's just gonna bring down as many people as he can with him. He gets a 3k before going down. And only useless will survive that. Which. It could be such a great blow if their economy wasn't already prospering. You know, I think that that three round streak of, um, a couple rounds ago, it's still just biting uh, Franny in the ass here. All right, and it, it it just feels weird because it feels like Townsend is not confident in their plays, but as soon as they get one pick, they manage to work it out. 
And I think, you know, if Franny can read that, then they'll stop playing um, maybe more aggressive in some games. Now we have the shadows, the omen ulti to rotate to A. Not sure why. Oh, wait. Professional might catch out Rosie here. Rosie's actually gonna find the kill on professional. Before getting just slashed have to get up, up the angle, yeah, that's a gun they can't retrieve, but that still is a kill. That's Eustace I think gets on a lot of damage speed. on him. <clears throat> now, leaving Sayo all alone on the B side again. The KO knife is gonna clear out mid, but you're gonna still walk up. The Sypho with the judge. Making sure the whole tree. Rosie spotted the mid though. And now useless is no flashes. Rosie with a marsh on top, but you know. Oh, He's been able to do a lot dog. with that. The fate dog misses. 30 seconds left. Sypho, and if they even decide to push that, maybe they'll just die. Oh! Rosie he gets one! Rosie can one! Oh. Not even the second, but that's enough damage for someone else to find the second for him. That omen's that that line is not gonna get anyone. He just finds the return. However, watch. They only have so much time left. Spike is down. He needs this kill. He's not gonna get it. There was no time that the kill was there. Townsend and Harris I... walk away with the with the with the half secured in their back pocket. Honestly, I'm I don't know how Townsend keeps on getting these rounds, but they do. And, you know their economy's thriving over it. Mm -hmm. And they do have but two ults online. Economy... They just had two back to back rounds where only one person survived, though. Their economy is taking a bit of a tank. That is true. I do want to point out they could. Trying to like you know get a more a bit more economy here. Careful they do have here. fatal. They could do some work. But Rosie with a guardian here. Ops not to peek though. I think that but... was a better choice. Yes, and they're pushing up A really fast here. Face your fear. Now here's over. Over. A rare sight to see from uh, Townsend. We got a double ult Phoenix Fade. As we're gonna get a professional kills Hayoshi, which is a really good pick. You don't you want that chamber off your site. Professional Fight trying to push, but Rosie's ulted. That's the Reyna ult. And this shit, this Sayo is just waiting. He's gonna find bottom frag with the classic before getting traded by uselessness. Sayo Rosie gets another. Phoenix. Here. And it's, it's actually pretty close. Standing. One enemy There's only one remaining. person left. Um. Oh, yes. smoke! Yeah. Another Phoenix round for Townsend. Right. Last but round in the half. Only Again, one person, one person survives. survives. But it's it's the last round. It doesn't matter. The half is actually secured. Back pocket. Yeah, but look at uh, Franny's uh, economy here. It's the last round. They're just they're doing what they can. Yoshi at least has all a sort of force. Wait, three alts on uh, Townsend Terrace. Is, uh... You want to play? Let's play. Right, there's a lot of alt economy here. They also have the Sage Res, which hasn't. Well, it has been used actually. Feeling sight. Which will give you a lot of. Um. Ability. Birdie's pushed up and finds Bottom Fred before running away. Phoenix finds Rosie. And Hiyoshi gets the trade. That's the Sage Res down. I don't A think they realize you can trust up here. Right. Heads up! Yusus gets Yusus, one. Yeah, he finds out. Sayo, and that was just, uh... You people, Yusus. Gets out with the 42 health, and now they're going to be running B. And he sells them all. He can heal himself. Just fine. Oh. Phoenix is still on B here. Look at that. It's a really good flank, but I think they're aware of it. One enemy remains. Oh, oh, he gets them. <laughs> he just switches onto Typho knowing he she does not have a gun at all. Switching sides. And he kills both of them, and that's 4 8 Tout said. They are running away with these rounds. Out of nowhere, too. You know, I think that's going to be their better half as well for Townsend. With the double duelist on uh, Franny's side, it might be a lot harder for them to hold it down. 
Alright. Now going into this defense half. I'm curious to see how Frenny Frenny's gonna play this. Are they gonna play the fast, aggressive? Are they gonna go slow? Are they gonna play mind games like Townsend did? I think I'm expecting a little bit more aggression. You, you know, we've uh Rosie's really showed that he can do a lot of and Phoenix. he has the, the aim to back it up, so... Phoenix and Hayoshi having a little bit of a jiggle match. Tree. You only have so many bullets on this chamber, Eagle. You can't waste them. And now they're already on a site. As Sypho finally gets two in response to Epoch's two kills. It's a 3v3. But Yuzis almost gets caught out here. Does get caught out, actually. Rosie's gonna find that trade. Now Phoenix finds one. Both of his opponents. This is really similar to last pistol around Phoenix being the last one alive. Yeah, but this time he's only got two people to work with instead of five. And he knows where both of them are. And watch the health. Ah. Uh. Unlucky. He gets Rosie to 19. All he needed was two shots. One to hit Rosie, one to hit Yoshi, but Franny going to find one round after four losses. It's looking like um, a B hit here. And you know, looking at a, a Townsend side, they only have one person on B here. Yeah, so they decided to rush this fast, this could be bad for them. They're throwing a lot of gamble here. Phoenix is probably gonna just try and get a freebie here. They are oh, he gets one. He gets That's pretty Rosie big. on a free pick. And there's a lot of damage being done here by Yozo. Yoz I can't pronounce his name. I'm gonna learn after this. I'm really sorry, guys. But yeah, a lot of damage has been done to them. Spike planted. And everyone's on right clicks and classics. Oh, but Saifo finds it to a professional. Hayoshi gets Izok. And there's also the Dink and everyone left standing for Franny is low. Saifo, looks like he's gonna push up onto CT here. Oh, but the shorty. It wins! The shorty misses! And it's almost a flawless. Okay, we know the drill. Stick to your rolls and Franny. And they're like slowly a, oh. crawling their way back into this game. Looks like Yoshi's gonna be forcing up on a rifle here. But can he do work with that? It's an interesting That's a true question. Very interesting choice, but... Oh, he oh, ends yeah. up selling it though. <laughs> I don't think oh, never mind. Sayo has it. Whoops. Oh. <laughs> oh, he wanted the skin. Uh... Skin shopping. me of everyone in this... In, in... All of you chatters know what it's like to, to just have skin in the game and then some guy comes up to you. Do you have this skin? Oh, it's terrible. You become a skin bag. Get out of my way! Oh yeah, you're gonna find Rosie mid. Maybe I'm able to get another one here and the no, birdie packs off. Franny is funneling towards mid. Birdie finds a trade out on useless. She's kind of left Stupid alone. Side. Gonna get some damage done. He's gonna like get a professional out. back of sight. Professional, Maybe. Yeah. He got one already. He has a spike and he's just to get out. Now watch. Sayo's in the smoke here. Not anymore. This could this is be. A 4v... This is a 4v3 for. Um... Right, but this could be Downs such a good position for Sayo. Oh. Finds one. Yoshi finds Phoenix. This is now winnable. Yoshi's also gonna find Butterfrag. It's all down to Professional. He's gonna find two, though. It's a 1v1. Teleport's ready. And the spike is ticking. He doesn't have a lot of time. Oh my god, ring around the rosy. Sypho is running circles around him. But, misses all his knives. Looks and like he's panicking a bit here. Time. He's just gonna play time. And professional gets it. Professional gets it, but Cypher's not gonna. There's no follow up. Uh. There's no spike defuse. He's not gonna go for it because he's out of time. Cypher plays that perfectly. And the round's gonna go to Franny. Seven to eight. 
Not down some looks like they're forcing up here. Or bonus? That works. They are bonusing. Yeah, I'm they are bonusing, okay. That's not ready. Bonne chance, mes amis. What could have been such a good round? The Townsend has turned into an absolute And now Rosie's got that rain off. Eos having a quick rotate here onto the A side. Bucky Bucky gonna it's one with that Bucky. And it actually gets rid of the rain off, which is so good, but Sayo gets two. Weird, weird push out from oh. useless. Ipo finds one through the smoke. Now watch Miyoshi. She's in a good position though. Like Yeah. Watch uh, Koji jumps up and gets absolutely dominated. And we're in a 3v2. Townsend does not want to lose guns here. They don't have too much entry here. So I get one. Out and gets one destroyed by professional. Oh. professional finds two! And this is the so one v one. No! The whiff comes oh, out. Oh, the whiff. But is there time? There's no time. There's a they time. Run again. They've run away with it. Cool. Around they should not be able to win. Turn the two around that they just win. The How many rounds is friend? How many rounds is friend gonna get like this? I don't this know, is two already just, two in a row. They've just earned four. They've just earned back every round they've lost in the last half. Professional might be getting those kills, but if you can't get the spike, it doesn't matter. Now we do have KO all on uh, no command coming out from um, a side. Are they going to use it though? So Professional can't get the first one. Is he going to stay here? He does decide to back off. Right, but, but so do. So does Franny. Franny. Going up at the tree here. Eos gets one. Yeah, but that's gets traded out. traded out. And you see the double duel coming to play. Never mind. Phoenix is gonna find Rosie in tree. Oh, Phoenix. Is... Oh, the Holy telly. Down. So watch Sayo. Oh, Last Phoenix gets two standing. with the telly. Can Sayo one before here? He gets one. Uh, he's not gonna get two. And this Molly lineup almost works, unfortunately. We good. We good. He doesn't finish. But, you know. That is the first round for Townsend. On the defense yes. side. And their eco doesn't look terrible. Only one of them is unable to buy um. Oh, actually, no, they get bought instead. The eco on a. Uh... On Franny's side. It's looking a bit iffy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think they're actually going to. A bit of a bonus. They're doing a weird save force thing here. Here. Presence detected both initiatives. You want to fighting. play? Let's play. With your respective utility. I do like the quick rotates coming out from both teams here. Right, Birdie's caught out trying to ult into both house. He just flashes his own teammate. Bottom frag is gonna find two. two. Rosie found one though. Birdie found one. It's a 2v3. They're on the site. Last player. She's gonna whip everything useless. Gets the third. It's another round going to Townsend. This is pretty good. They needed to win that round. And now they put the, the economy on a, a Franny in shambles. Eight to ten. Franny on a save. Towson most likely get it to eight to eleven. And oh, actually, Franny's on a buy. They're in a force. Towson can get this to eleven. They get a free match point because Franny's gonna have to save the round after. Another A hit.
Right. Okay, I'm not just not gonna find anything except for a semblance of presence as it's shot out. Meanwhile, I guess the site's kind of being deserted. It's really only Eos here holding it. But there's no sound, no Bottom pressure. Frank. Bottom Frank's really just waiting for the entry so he can pop his ult. Right, his but ult. they pretend to leave. They made all that sound and they're coming back slowly. Sypho pretending that they're running down mid and just shooting different angles. The wall is broken. And Eos actually is kind of exposed. A free pick. He's gonna go for BK. He gets oh, two! Gets two. Spike down. Oh, he's pretty huge. Oh, but Yusuf's remaining. gonna get it. both of them! And now it's, oh, Sal too. Sypho who has a spike. Can he find the kills? With 30 seconds left. He doesn't have a lot of choices here. 30 seconds left. There's the flash. That's the last of the flashes. He overheats a bit. Panics too. Townsend run away with 11 rounds. But Franny on a save. That's a free match point. Unless Franny plays this really well, you know. Unless Franny decides. We should not to we play. should not discount them. They have won rounds like this before. They have. But you know, if, if all goes according to plan, if it's if it if it all goes according to the script, then who knows? Townsend takes those. There's a KO knife finding Eo, pushing him out of his wall hiding spot. Phoenix is gonna smoke that off. Bullets nah, I, do fall wanna... I do wanna mention Franny has only done full sight pushes with um with, with their chamber lurking up, Hiyoshi. Mm -hmm. Hiyoshi does get one though. That That's lurk does come out to That's help. A... So worth it. And now it's also eliciting a response. Eo has some moves. They end up getting off of that B main as well. Looking like they're going towards A. Straight into Eo's here. But Eo's falls off. Yeah, and I think they're gonna just walk into the tree. They're, they're actually... Wait, they're just gonna get it for free. Rotating off of A, that's a free site. No, but now they, they've, heard the, they've heard the window break. They spotted out the dog. Plant's gonna go down with no resistance, but... So is the res. I know it's a 5v5. It's a 5v4. I take it back. Townsend. Heyo playing for lineups. But he does oh, get one with it. Oh, but Saifo and Sayo both find respective marks. And so oh, does useless. Last player standing. Whiffs the knives. Useless. All of Sayo here. Gets one. Right, but Sayo has the molly, has the time. All he has to do is play this smartly. But he can't! And that's his fight. And that's match point. Day to day. Easy. One round is all Townsend needs, and they can take this home. Match point. Brandon does have two ults, though Empress and Null Command. Right, Who needs but we a weapon? Who needs a weapon? Who needs a weapon? All right, who needs a weapon? You need a weapon. You need to shut up. Anyways, guys, I'm not violent. Um, I do want to point out the economy on uh, Franny as well. It's actually, the, it's not they, terrible. They, yeah, but... they've something together. They've got something. Um, but the well, question is, that's something that. enough. Rosie pushing up. Being really aggro angle. Yeah. Now this Empress needs to work out here. They have no resistance coming onto this site. Oh. oh, but bottom track is gonna take out Empress. What in the world is going on? Sayo's gonna go down to useless. The professional finds a kill somewhere. Phoenix finds Yoshi. Finally uses it. It all runs out. Birdie's gonna find professional. Sayo's actually not. Sayo's just gonna go down. Sypho, uselessness! One it's one person, oh it's nobody! God. Uselessness finds the last person. That's the that's the map over. And, and In favor of Townsend. Gonna... Yeah, not look like Townsend was going to win that at the start. But then they just dominated. They came back. Even when Franny seemed like they were going to come back. 
The town center went, no. We win lead. You know, First I think they I think their ability to play time there was really good. Mm -hmm. You know, there was a lot of rounds that uh GG's. And they ended up winning with that. GG's, GG's. GG. Uh and the next map is what again? Ooh, okay. Now what do you expect to see, Dolphy? I'm expecting to see probably a brim here. Probably a raise. Maybe we'll see another Phoenix actually. Yeah, Eustace was pretty strong on that. Wait, we have a coach? There's a coach. There's a coach, okay. That's interesting. That's probably the sub. Oh yeah, maybe. Could be. Alright, chat's going crazy. Let me look at it. Damn. Left is uh Townsend, I think. Right? Well, let me check. Uh <coughs> And I guess we're going into the second map. Uh right is Townsend. Right is Townsend. Right is Townsend. No All right. So yeah, like I said, uh, definitely the rays. Of course, oh, the chamber. Obviously the chamber. Can't, yeah. Can't play this game without a chamber. If you don't have a chamber on your team, what are you doing? Right. Harbor. <laughs> Uselessness on Phoenix again. A harbor comp could work if they had two smokes, and I would be very interested in seeing that actually. I would love to see that. But I don't think we're gonna get it this game. A Viper, okay. So, a pretty solid lineup. Very traditional for... comp for Franny. On the left. Yeah, it's a pretty, pretty solid lineup for them. Meanwhile, uh... I can't tell what bottom frack is gonna play. Yeah. But I think you, but... you were right about the Brim. And, and the use, do... uses on Phoenix as well. We have Astra, are they doing for going for double smokes? Well, if they're going for Astra, I think a Viper would have complimented uh, that. I know, but there's a Chamber. It was just a troll pick. Damn. You can never tell. These guys just like cycling through agents. Select your agent. <coughs> Great. Final teams. We have the fade again versus the KO. Double duelist versus double sentinel. These matches are actually almost identical to the ones we just had on Ascent. And I want to say again, I don't think double duelists are necessary. Especially not a bind, which is such a closed site. I feel like one duelist is enough, especially if you're going to have a chamber on your team. But, you know, we'll see how everyone plays this out. And especially since we're seeing a different side. Different starting size. Yeah, Townsend's starting on attacker, right? Mm hmm. Okay. Oh no. Townsend is starting on. Attack. Yeah, wait, what? Yeah, attacker. Okay. Looks like they're stacking a uh, chamber and Viper on A. I think that's a pretty good choice. You know, the two, the two angels really are able to hold down sites, but it doesn't look like they're going to be able to do much here. Hmm. First round, of course. Yeah. Townsend's going to be going towards B. Oh, and a beautiful I guess the opening pick. And this is why you want a chamber on your team, especially when we can aim. Uselessness. Spots outside of Sayo also spots on Uselessness. That was a two-way play. 
Yeah, I'm gonna get some chip damage. Uh, Yuzun is actually out on the site now. Psycho Birdie finds two kills. Yuzun is really struggling to get any like entry on site here. Right. I think it's it, look... it does look like they're rotating off a bit here. Dry. Almost no util used on the site to get on. And our bottom frag rendered kind of useless actually by the KO knife. TP hit. Now the real question, are they planning to go A or are they going to re-hit B? It does it look like they're going to stay towards B. It might just be professional baiting. Getting this orb, is there a... Uh, walk back B, do they know A? 30 seconds himself? left. Flash. He flashes too, he sees both of them. Hey, you can and see the rotates coming rotating. in from that. But still, no moves. Townsend really don't like to make moves. What a nice shot from Birdie. Down, As 10 seconds on the clock, that spike is not going to any time. Last player standing. Right. Really good round from uh, from Franny here. Man, spike, spike just doesn't go down. Yeah, I think it's something similar from what happened uh, last match. Townsend was just really struggling to get onto those sites. And with Useless just not seemingly dying with no util used. That works. Yes. No problem. Looks like they're going towards B again. All right. A lot slower this time. Well, Sadly, they're going to be running straight into four people. Yeah, like what is this? What is what was the setup? But I mean, if it works, Yusus has a shorty to entry, which I think is the biggest mistake of his life. He doesn't have the same capabilities as a jet or a ray, so he can go flying in and just shorty someone out of the blue. Yeah, that and is why Phoenix him. isn't strong. Yeah, now Rosie has help. <gasps> and gets Ooh, he one gets one kill though. for get destroyed actually by professional. And any picks are good here. Spike, I'm gonna go down, but professional Yoshi is able to get gonna one. go down. Spike planted. Some chip damage from the satchel. Ooh. A beautiful right click to the face. It's a 3v3. You don't want your games to be this close when the enemy has almost nothing, actually. Yosa's is going to find one. Phoenix going to get the return. One enemy remaining. Thank God. They win their bonus. Another another rapper, Franny. That's not their bonus, it's their force. Team uh, force. Ace. Hey guys, channel points are out. Predict I mean, predictions are out. Gamble your channel points and oh, see let me, which let me school prevails. Go, go, go. Five minute time limit on those predictions. Anyone that's just joining in, this is game two of the BL3 match between Francis Lewis and Townsend. Anyway. Now, now let's at the Viper swapping sides here. They're gonna be looking going towards B. Yeah, no, they want to play closer angles or further angles depending on the weapons they have, because they don't have vandals and vandals they need to do like running guns. <laughs> yeah, professional, such a strong force in this game right now takes down Rosie. Here. Watch there's three coming up long. Sao does not know what he's going to be peeking into. Sao, kind of stuck, I guess. Yoshi keeps looking. And the dog's not going to clear him out, but his location is revealed. And Saifo finds one, but yeah. Yoshi's trying to escape with his life, can't quite. Yeah, leaving for, leaving it into a 2v4 for Franny. Can they win their bonus here? And I can imagine what's being said right now is any picks. Are good. Oh, yeah, one pick. gonna find one pick. And I thought where Yusuf is on the side. Yusuf finds Birdie. They, they know now. One's All up to Saifo. My ult's not ready. 
Ah, oh, but he's well off. A marshmallow, a ghost, a dream. One engine, because he can't break that. And now there's a brim smoke. It doesn't look like that. That dream's gonna be a reality, though. He's just gonna run it down. Oh, Ooh, he does get one, though. He's gonna find one. Out of charges. Yeah, and he plays it. He tries to play a lot of time, but he can't get any more than one, but still a good round, actually. They get two guns. They get two guns out. No, the question is, can they pull by again? Professional has the ult. Bottom frag and useless can buy their teammates. If they wish. It could be getting a, a pseudo full by here with that, uh, by that sort of force. Oh, but a Viper all coming, like, Viper all online for Birdie. Yeah, you think Birdie's gonna ult that hookah? You want to play? Honestly, Let's play. anything's down. Like anything's. Birdie doesn't. Where did did Birdie place a uh, smoke cloud? Oh. Oh. Phoenix. Uh, Phoenix bought it out. I mean, he might have not bought it. I don't think he put it down. I don't think he bought the it. Spike. Yeah. It's kind of a down. calm standstill right now. Still waiting, still waiting. Ooh, you just got spawned. No more waiting. Oh, there's a cloud smoke. I'm blind. <laughs> yeah, and the nade's actually gonna fight. Yeah, it's... And we're back in this like 4v4 standoff. Like, where are they, where are they gonna hit? Who Yusuf's knows? in a good position here. He... He's a professional right now. Oh, but the Sword of Force is now taken away. He has to run, 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 run. And Birdie's gonna find him. Gets one. One round, but now watch the health. Birdie's low. Careful now. Oh, and that's a perfect volley. Embarrassing. My ultimate's ready. 30 seconds left. Oh my god, Professor finds Saya useless. And they know where the last person is. They know he or she's in that teleporter coming through because they're gonna plant that site. Planted. He gets one though. Yeah, but that was the lowest. Now, does he know where everyone else is? Is the real question. I think he knows where Chamber is. I don't think he knows where Useless is though. So watch it. It's not the back to tight. Oh, Ooh, now he does though. Molly comes out. It's a very good Molly. Useless is just gonna take that opportunity to completely relocate. And now they can just jump over the box. And just. I am not yeah. Like, Another one for Townsend. Like professional just said. Clean this up. <laughs> and it's a beautiful cleanup. So, 2 2. And Townsend on the fold by while Franny kind of grasping at straws here, looking for anything. And this is kind of going. Uh, similar to our last game. Where Franny would win the pistols, but couldn't bring that momentum with them anywhere else. It is looking like that. And it's also looking like the first A hit of the match. Of the map. Come on, let's go! Yusa does pop the ult, though. Gonna get a lot of space for his team. He does kill one. Good kill. Spike planted. Useless is actually not useless, uh, if you wanted to say that. <laughs> but he is not. He's also been very useful for his team. Uh, professional is in shower, that's a lurk you stole. They're out eventually. Waterfrag oh, gave us good too. Yeah, left on one health, but you know, it just takes a nice little back Oops. off. Rosie finds useless. Now I would that say this is standing. winnable. But Professional still has a shower spot. And yeah, there's one kill, but... No, I think the win was... Not uh, enough. The win was impossible after Rosie jump peeks that. Mm -hmm. You know, leaving Sion a 1v4, it's just... I don't think it's too winnable. Now watch the alt yeah, economy. Because... Four Franny, alts. Franny only says five. But... They do have no economy. They have no creds. They're only able to buy one rifle here. Right. 
But it does look like Jet Knives is gonna come out. So Saifo is gonna respond to those Jet Knives. Phoenix ready to ult. Watch your eyes. I was gonna ult U-Haul. And that's a beautiful U-Haul ult. Especially because it gets rid of Saifo's Chamber ult that clears out a lot of space, gets him off the site. Look at Yoshi. Oh, oh can't, can't get even one there. Yeah, it does damage, but that's all it does, and it doesn't matter. Useless still kills someone, even with the health debuff. Professional is gonna spot out Yoshi here. And he does end Free it. kill. Is he gonna keep pushing up? No, he decides not to. Saifo is in a very peculiar spot right now. Oh my god. Professional going big for fucking, for, uh, for attackers Dude, here. Yeah. Two more kills, and then he's hunting down Sayo. Sayo gets a kill first. He's gonna take that vandal. Is he gonna save it? Or is he gonna run? He's gonna save it. As if he doesn't know who's behind him. And Townsend run away with four rounds in a row. Who needs a weapon? I do wanna say, I think Useless is kinda of throwing a lot of rounds here. He keeps on over aggressing. I know no. there it didn't really matter, but. Useless in is... some other rounds, he has been over aggressing, he has been dying. Man, but this game is really round. good. This game, yeah. He's been getting all those first bloods, so Stay who focused. cares if he over aggresses a little bit? Rosie hasn't been able to find the same success though, as last match. Right. But well, Rosie's got the, uh, the operator now, so we'll see how that works out. There. It's taking a lot slower this round. Rotating towards A though. Yeah. There. It's kind of just a slow walk up. But watch, Sifo's already here. Sifo's. But it's only Sifo. Face your fear. Maybe and the fade out comes out. Fade out's not gonna find either of them though. Sage wall goes up. Uh, Birdie spotted, not killed. Mollied off as Yusuf finds his first pick of the game again. Saifo finds Phoenix. Can't fight Eos. And Rosie is not having a good day with that AWP. Useless. Finds Sayo. And now it's all up to Yoshi and Rosie. Rosie with the AWP is gonna die. Useless finds Yoshi. He's going big this game. He's getting all these, these important picks. I think he heard what he said. He took it personally. He took it personally. I am sorry, man, but hey, you're winning. Another weird force round from Franny. I'm not wrong, right? That is weird. No, yeah, that's very. Oh, but Birdie got off of it, though. Nope. <laughs> These players Look, never. They're see going for a bit more of a me. force, I want to say. Yeah. A Rosie with a judge. That judge could be so good right now. Joke's over. But it's the first time we've seen a judge come out. That's one. Oh it's my god, two. he does this okay. They don't let they don't have the fade dog to clear a hookah, huh? They should have just let her. Now Rosie's gonna sit under that hookah and a judge is so good in that position. If they push it, goes back into hookah. Look at the rotating back to A though. Yeah, Townsend is on the move. Yoshi finds one. Down a. Now Brody's professional is gonna find the page. All the way across the other side of the map, Yoshi finds two. Brody finds Phoenix. That's a spike down. Professional oh. all by himself. We, we, we know who, where he is. He can't quite get it. Brandy finally find a round. First time in like five. Now, did you vote for your, with your predictions on the Twitch stream? Both of Nah. Damn. I didn't predict. Birdie still has that ult, that Viper ult though. That Viper's pit. Doesn't seem like he's gonna use it though. Grenade. 
Yeah. Lots of chip damage is useless. Actually, I think he's gonna die to the nade here. He doesn't. He's left on one health as he's gonna heal it all back, but that was really close. The Viper finally comes out, but... Yeah, but too late. No and in an awkward position as well. Doesn't really cover any entrances. Now Sayo is playing under hookah position. Rosie's gonna peek into two different people. Yoshi finds Iot before getting traded out by Phoenix. They didn't use Sayo though. Doesn't Sayo, Sayo use uh... spike down B. Prevents a tragedy from happening. 2v3. Spike planted. Psycho finds useless. And now it's a 2v2, but everyone is known. Professional one time birdie. Remaining. It's a 1v1 Sypho, a one hit. Bottom frag. Bottom frag with no utility. Oh, uh, but he still hit. gets it. It would have been a one hit if it was the head, but Townsend. Taking another round. Their sixth round, and they've secured the half. Anyone feeling generous? They took your life. Thank you. Brandon's gonna be forcing again. Anyone feeling generous? If they lose this round, I don't think their economy is gonna be able to take it. <laughs> Alright, we're going back into this round. It's looking like a B split. Yeah. Being a professional has gone big, going B long on multiple rounds. Yeah, Townsend really likes B. Well, they uh, have gotten the most success on it. That's true. Yeah, and Use Useless finds another first blood. Professional, Professional finds the other. No. Yeah, Yoshi is not having a good day right now. Spassing out as he tries to find. He would've got one though. Yeah, but he has no bullets left. Ooh, Aerial oh my god. Though. Rosie finds two going a little one bit bigger. Remaining. Yoshi Last finds one of them. It's a 1v1. Saifo don't beat. overheat. Somehow it's got back to a 1v1. Right, but it's always Saifo. It. It's always Saifo. It's always like one health. A bit of BM there. But those were beautiful movements from Yoshi, especially, uh, you know, having no bullets left in the clip. Survives to be able to take down bottom frag. Yoshi's but, very good with uh, his satchel movement. Um, I think it's, it's kept him alive a lot. There's just so much... Pressure. So much stress. You can see he, uh, Yoshi almost spazzing out like... Where is his fade eye? Why can't I shoot it? He's getting rushed by five people. It is a stressful situation to be in. Oh, no, and the running back's gonna come out. Push. Wow. Rosie finds professional. All the way from showers. <gasps> Oh, Rosie can't click another though. Yeah, with all the knives. Here's the rocket launcher though. Getting a Spike kill and not eight. dying. And the spike's not planted. Now that's a bad position. Oh, and this attack round is just falling apart. Nice. Now all yeah. up to bottom frag. Able to get one. The question is, can he get three? One is low. Two of them are basically full health. And Butterfrag is not in a good position. He only has Haunt though. Gonna have a lot of trouble trying to clear his corner. And clear sight on his entry. And he opts to save. And I think that's a smart move here. Yeah. 30 seconds left. I mean, he's, he's, he's got 30 health. How much impact can he possibly have? Did he switch crosshairs mid-round? Oh, people do that. Okay. Ten seconds left. It's going back in now. I mean, he finds... Bottom he finds Sypho, yeah. He finds Sypho, but he's not gonna get Last Yoshi. Round before the switch. And 4-7, Townsend winning. Four alts on the side of Townsend here. 
just every I, everything except for the running back. I think that running back would have really helped them secure this round as well. You want to play? Let's play. Another hit towards B. No, that's really been working for them. Mm -hmm. And it's just a slow walk up again. Townsend likes to play these rounds really slow. But it has caused him to lose them as out. well. Yeah, and that's a perfect kill on Tasayo. Oh, uh, useless. Fights too. That's, that's a response from Tasayo. Oh. That's no enemy They were good Hiyoshi as well. Rosie left in a 1v3. 1v3, who's about to come up? 1v4 actually, if you will not no, we get the off. Yeah, we get the ult pop there. Spike planted. Now, can he prove himself again? No, he can't. He cannot. 4 8. Exact same score as last game. Switching sides. But are we gonna have a swap here? Is Franny gonna be able to take it this time? Anyone feeling generous? Who knows? Now I do wonder how uh, Townsend's gonna be playing this on defense. They're only able to hit, really find good success on B. So I wonder how the retakes are gonna work on A. That works. A gift. That nade does so much damage to bottom five. And they're both gonna get pushed out by this KO knife. Kiyoshi yeah, flies into back of sight. Yeah, and it's really good. It, a beautiful class kill into useless. Planted. Spike goes down with minimal damage done to Fran. Yoshi gonna take a lot of damage there. He just finds the kill. Is Yoshi gonna peek this, on, really? We're on fair playing ground here. And Yoshi. Almost. Almost gets this kill. Professional finds the kill. He does get it. Well, he does. Nah, but he's gonna get the nade off before dying at least. Two v three. Birdie gets. Oh, oh my God! Birdie just gets on two people like it's nothing. He really comes in clutch for his team here. Franny able to take a first round on second half. Now, uh, Franny's gonna go back into the forest. But we have a lot of shorties and frenzies on the side oh. of Townsend. What is this hookah play? <laughs> the cross on hookah. Oh, no. I hope they don't push that. I don't think they're gonna see it in action. Unlucky. You know, they're just gonna run it down. Oh. Hey, he flashes himself and flashes Rosie. Yeah. Everyone who was holding A is just kind of dead now. Spike we'll settle planted. into the 5v3. I wonder how, um, how Townsend Harris is going to take this. They'll probably just look for the picks they can, especially since two of them have shorties. That is true. Ryan, it looks like they're looking for exit, S exit picks. Looking for people to run away from the spike yeah. explosion. Yeah, Phoenix is not gonna get Rosie at all. Ooh, so close! Last player standing. Oh, I'm professional, isn't oh. he able to get one either? He is, though. The problem though. here is that they've gotten everyone low on Franny, but they've gotten no kills. They're going to scatter from my stuff. Another so good Franny's round for Franny, gonna, though. Yeah, Franny's just gonna take that round. And the force coming out from Townsend. Sypho also decides to force up onto a Vandal. That's weird. It could work out for them. Okay. Sypho has proven himself to be pretty um, 
mechanically gifted. He's done some some clutch stuff. He's almost been able to clutch up a couple rounds on uh first half. Right. And it, it seems like another A hit, but you have to see. They're actually going B, I think, because... I think it's a little bit more of a default. Right. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Probably the smartest play here. Sayo's not gonna get any damage done there. And he's gonna keep going for it, but that doesn't mean he'll get anything. Looks like they're ending towards B, though. Yeah, it's a lot more obvious now. With only really Eos on the site. Mahuka walled off. No Eos there, though. He gets one. He gets one. Can you get the second here? He's able to get a second one. And Professional's gonna get the third off of a chamber teleport in. Sia with another lineup? Yeah, he's just gonna throw a see if he gets anyone from default. How many lineups does this guy have? Line up Larry. But he doesn't hit anyone. 30 seconds left. Yeah, he's not just gonna to go down. Anyone. So, not much going on there. Like a force coming out from uh, from Franny. Except for Sypho. Not gonna be able to buy much because of last round's uh <laughs> force to a vandal. Yeah. But some things seem worth it, so it's another default. Actually Rosie's gonna find Phoenix. And I guess they're gonna do an A hit, but they don't have their full team here. It's very awkward. They hit. do get useless though. Birdie gets useless. Professional finds a trade on Sayo. But that's on the other side of the map. So, Toto down to the 4v3. Viper ult. I think he learned out. his lesson from last half. He didn't just save it. Yeah, and Rose is gonna find bottom frag again now with the 2v3. And that Viper ult looks oh. impenetrable. But, Rose is gonna go down. Oh my god. And Professional is gonna get Birdie through the smoke. It's a 2v2, this is winnable. We have the wall as well. Now, Spike is gonna start getting defused. One enemy remaining. Last Actually, player it's another. Standing. Can he get the fourth? No, he no, can't no. get the fourth. Good classic as Yoshi decides to reload. Anyone have any splits? That's the size of the entire round. Fingers. Fingers. Yoshi's ability to just stay alive, it's impeccable. Alright, now the. Wait. Party rockets on. Line. Blade storm online for Rosie, but no need to use that. And professional is definitely gonna pop toward a force. Yeah, I was just about to say. Let's look at another A hit. The A entry coming up from Franny is pretty good. It's just their uh it's their sight hold. Is the chat really debating the difference between a force and a full buy right now? Oh, they are? Oh, wait, they are. <laughs> oh, bottom frags got such a good positioning. He needs to hurry up a bit. He's uh... not gonna get Sayo. Oh, but he does get Sayo low and there are no heals, so it might have been worse. The showstopper's coming out. Yeah, but. Oh, uh, well. He does get one. Yeah, but they're not having a good day, Spike professional fine. B. Smoke finds oh, Hiyoshi. entry, Remaining. useless, finds Saifo, it's all down to Sayo and he's got one health. You breathe on him, he dies, Phoenix finds that out. And Townsend the Harris MVP is mine. want Let's this win, they want to stay in this game. Hey. Actually no, they want to end this game. I forgot, we're not, we're not in a bracket yet. Oh yeah, we are in a bracket. A lot of ults here are really close to being up here. You know. Grimal, overall strike. Nightfall. But the jet knives are gonna be coming out right now. Yeah, there's a blaze storm. 
looking for a pick. They're defaulting really heavily. There. No, I, I, we all know Kiyoshi. Ooh. Oh my god. Rosie. It's a perfect kill. Yeah, and a professional's actually kind of caught out. Oh, he teleports straight into Sayo's crosshair. What is this uselessness? Uh, Rosie whiffs, but also doesn't die, and now we're down to a 3v3. Where... He escapes with his life. Oh, but we have the Phoenix out, and he finds Rosie. Can he find anyone else? One enemy remaining. This is his ace! This is his ace! And he's going to take an easy esports ace! The first of the season. And it's the first match as well. Yeah, Useless is doing really good this game. Ace! 7 11. And we're basically going to go to match point here. Your star shines bright. <laughs> well, you know, no, Franny's economy Franny's surprisingly isn't that bad. Yeah, this round has been going pretty even, but you don't want that because you're down by four rounds. <laughs> it looks like they're going to force up here. If they do lose this, I think it's going to be another free win for uh, for Townsend. Cause they're gonna be on an eco after this. Uh huh. And he's heading towards B. Yo's playing under. Yeah, the wall's broken here. Ultron <laughs> comes here. out. Oh, they check. Oh wow, that's a lot of kills coming out right now. That's oh my god! Bottom track gets three professionals. Finds the two he missed. Match that was point. clean. <laughs> the denial of the entry. Oh, the sight take. Like he shot them how? all out of the air, basically too. But match point. Franny does not have a buy. I think this is the game. I think this is it. Commentator's curse. Come on, <laughs> they can still do it. Oh nah. You want to play? Let's play. Tour of Force is going to be coming out as well. Right. This is going to get the pick. No! Oh my god! Oh. Huge pick for Townsend. Yeah, an EO. Caught out. Look at this TP. They find Spike. They have professional with them. It's all down to Sayo now. Stuck in hookah is gonna get bombarded. It's a 2v3. Wall's going out. And he or she is on one health because it's fatal. And yeah, that's my stuck. They are absolutely stuck. Last player standing. Oh, yes, the wall bang out. And it's a Townsend win. 2-0. 2-0. Wow, what a amazing sweep by townsend harris what a strong showing who do you guys think the mvp or was i gotta be i was gonna say professional yeah professional or useless they're both just this map they really showed themselves useless with those entries on with the running back it was it was really good so we're between professional and uselessness right now hmm. okay who should we drag in for an MVP interview? I would say, I would useless. say useless. Useless? Yeah. All right. What do you think, Dolphy? Well, I guess drag useless in here. Uh, useless, useless had a lot of effects. Actually, I think first half and professional just came out second half and it was kind of like a, you know, a synergy. One would carry the first half, one, one helped out the other. So who do you think we should take here? Uh, let's get let's get useless in. Okay. Hey, Paul, can, are you with us, Mister Uselessness? Hello. Oh yeah. Hello. All right, we are live, and you're speaking to the Twitch audience. First off, congratulations to your win. 
Your yeah, first win eight. as Townsend Harris esports team. How does it feel? Yeah. Pretty good, pretty good. All right. Oh, I have a question. We should, um, we should probably have you introduce your full name, school, grade, and your position in your Valorant team. I'm a flasher or a duelist? You'd be yeah. a duelist. You were running yeah. a duelist, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, during your ace, what was going on through your through your head? Uh, run at them. Run at them? Yeah. That was it? Yep. That's was it. that like what you were thinking the entire game? <laughs> no. Just for that ace. Oh. Just for that ace. Well, you did really good that round. Thank you. And the whole game. Any other questions? Townsend Harris prepped their games coming into their debut game because because Townsend Harris this is their very first esports match, and there's a lot of hype around Townsend. This is their first esports match, and you guys came out proving to everybody that Townsend Harris has something to show. So, is there anything that your team did? Any prep work? Um, team's kind of new. I don't. I won't lie. We kind of just put it together really quickly. <laughs> kind of scuffed. But, um, hey, but you were still, you pretty, were still uh, able to get that 2 0 here. Yeah. Pretty proud of my team. We were able to get the win. But 2 0. Alright, wonderful. Uh, so, <clears throat> who who else do you think was would be considered MVP during that? BO3 match. Um, because our shoutcasters thought you were the MVP, uh, and do you feel like you deserved it? Or, I mean, I'll take it if I can. All <laughs> right, damn. So, there we have it, fellas. Uh, Kyle himself, the MVP of this match, said that they didn't really do any preparation. So, Francis Lewis, personally, I would not take that type of disrespect. Uh, Uh, yeah, uh, Shotcasters, do you guys have any other, other questions? No, not really. But really good work, really good performance from Uselessness. Thank you. Alrighty, folks, that wraps up our debut stream, and anybody who's just tuning in, you are too late. This VO3 just ended, and it is Townsend Harris Sweep 2-0. Be sure to check out our Instagram, our Discord. All the social medias are in the bio. Be sure to follow those. And if you want to become a shoutcaster, we have shoutcaster forms available. Thank you everybody for tuning in. And just to conclude ourselves, we are going to do a quick, uh, yep. And then we're gonna end up. All right, thank you for watching. I am Winnie Zong. Senior Silent Tech, and I was your broadcaster for tonight. I'm Dolphy Vix. I was a, I'm a sophomore at Stye. I was one of your shoutcasters. Thank you for tuning in, guys. I'm Lewis. I'm the other shoutcaster, junior at Stuyvesant. And I am Edison Zong, founder of Easy Esports. Thank you, everybody, for tuning in. Have a wonderful night, and have a wonderful rest of your weekend. Take care, everybody. Good night. Good night. Thank you. Good night. Thank you. And oh, and happy Easy Esports first birthday! Wait, Winnie, did we end the stream yet? No. Yeah, oh my gosh! I completely forgot. Yo, today is Easy Esports first birthday. I should probably share a little bit about that. Um, November 18th marks the first day that Easy Esports was founded. Um, this was the day that a bunch of club presidents from various schools got together in one voice call. And then we're like... There should be a New York City High School Esports League. And this is why we're all here. And this is how far we came. And this is only our first year. And we have so much more planned for the years ahead of, ahead of us. Um, yeah. We, we really appreciate all the support. And we reached about like 170 live viewers at some point. Which is pretty amazing. Thank you guys for your support. And we hope to see you guys tune back in. Take care. Good night, guys. Good night. Thank you.